This is part two of the Japanese uniforms used by the Imperial Japanese Army during World War II. In this video, I am going to talk about the different hats and different helmets used by the Imperial Japanese Army at the time. The hat was a very important and fundamental part of the uniform. This one here is one of the most common hats that you will find. This hat was given to soldiers and officials at the time of service. The hat came in the color of khaki and green olive. At the front of the hat is the fine point star. This represented the Imperial Japanese troops at the time. This hat was primarily used for parades and events. This other hat you see here was mostly used for work outside. The Japanese know this hat as Senbu. This model will also have the star on front embroidered with the strap to be adjustable to the chin. For the tropical regions, you will find a hat like this with four covers that will have this on the back to protect the soldier from the sun. This type was called Butare. This was one of the first helmets produced by the Japanese government called the Type 92 and in Japanese, Tetsubo, but also known as Tetsukabuto, which means helmet made out of steel. This helmet came out to be very fragile and did not provide the protection the Japanese needed against machine guns at the time. This helmet came in different colors, khaki, white for the snow, and olive green for tropical places. This helmet would also have the five-point star on the front, and it will have a strap that will go onto your chin. The Type 92 had two different variants, the Type 90 and the Type 92. The Type 90 would have holes on the top for ventilation. And the Type 92 would have a cover and a net that could be used for camouflage by applying leaves and stuff around the jungles. This helmet came out in different colors, from khaki to white.